All righty, let's go and check out this little shot. <laughs> Wasn't that just magnificent? I was worried it was getting a little dodgy in the middle part, but then that finale, <laughs> wow. All right. Hmm. I have uh, some concerns about some of the moves. <laughs> Wasn't that just magnificent? So there are a couple of things. A, you are in this pose here. <laughs> Wasn't that just magnificent? And doing all this, this is what? Oh. Uh, less than a third almost a quarter like this is there's a lot of repetition there's really nothing going on besides that and then you re repeat this whole thing um I, don't, I would i know there's a kind of the rhythm to the clapping <laughs> wasn't that just magnificent but maybe there could be something where um you know i don't know i'm spitballing here maybe he's up or upright and at the end he is there and maybe throughout the whole thing also the the bo the head and the body the head goes left and right and bobs while still keeping the rhythm of the clapping you know what i mean like something where there's a bit more contrast going from from a to b or the opposite or this and get straight up whatever you want to do but i would try to get something a bit more contrasty so it's not always the same because it's like that for quite some time the second thing is, and this is an overall thing, I think you have a lot of body moves that don't really reflect um, the... Basically, there's nothing in the voice that reflects that move. Meaning that if you listen to the voice... Magnificent? I was worried it was getting... I know he inhales here. I was worried it... So that could work, actually, to be honest. It was getting a little dodgy in the middle part, but then that... But this... Part, but then that... Even if it's a tiny bit of a break, the voice doesn't really sound as if someone in the middle part, but then that's jumping like this. In the middle part, but then there's no strain in the voice. That finale, <laughs> wow! Even this, that's a crazy ginormous jump towards camera, which in general I'm not sure. Again, the voice doesn't quite match this. Then again, to be honest, to me this is not very uncommon. I mean, it's in movies, since people are being recorded in a booth. They don't really match the energy on screen anyways. It, I see it a lot, and it's not like people complain about it. I was very picky about this, but again, to me, this is the contrast is a bit flat here. Just magnificent. I was even though I like the action, I would just, you know, push this. I was this I like. I just be careful. You're going to need more breakdowns. You're going to have to flesh this out. This is going to be very fast and zippy. Which you can, I'm not saying you cannot. So if that's your style, you can get away with some interesting timing. I was worried. I was worried. And it does work throughout the, uh, you know, the inhale. I would just look at, is he starting this with one frame, like a foot goes out as the anticipation there? Or the body does this whole thing, but it's still twisted and the head is still looking at us and it's really a big ginormous twist. So you might be able to push those breakdowns and in-betweens into something really cool. I was worried it was getting a little dodgy in the middle part, but then that... It's just to me it is. In the middle part, but then that finale. I guess you could kind of get away with this. Again, I'm being picky, but on the, f the first time I watched this, this was already slightly suspect. And this going, wow, this doesn't really match the voice at all. Part, but then that finale. <laughs> wow. And I know... This is again, it might be very subjective, but like I like the actions, I like that he goes back, I like the interaction with this, and it's it's interesting that you know he goes to all those different places. I think mechanically it's all very interesting, but then this feels it just feels to me over animated. It's like with the cross-eyed face and this big jump towards camera and not quite matching the voice energy. I'm to be honest, not a massive fan, but I'm not saying it's wrong. So that was just my impression seeing this. Hmm, I'm not a huge fan of this, but that doesn't mean you need to stop and change it. So it's kind of a wishy washy critique, but. Ally! <laughs> wow! Because I mean, there is more energy in the voice. <laughs> wow! I don't know. That's why I'm hesitating. Am I being too picky about this? The first impression was, ah, oh, this doesn't work. And the more I listen to it, I'm like, yeah, maybe it does work. <laughs> maybe. I'm just getting used to that voice, but anyway, that's my, that's the main thing. Probably the most actionable things would be, I would add more contrast and change in the posing. It's not so flat. Um, work on your, he's out of this and how are you going to, what's going to lead first. Again, it could be fun to just have 
the that leg go out and then sh and then do a twist and the head stays put you know push that time it could be fun it's getting a little dodgy in the middle part but then that fun yeah again that i think i'm just gonna leave this to being slightly subjective personally f i feel it doesn't too much energy is that so much movement in the body with the jump would be a, be a slight change in the voice especially at the end well let's pretend we're keeping all of this this just seems so presentational to camera which i mean he is talking to camera but it's just something about this that it's such a big jump i really don't hear that in the voice um but like i said it's not uncommon it's not like it doesn't happen in movies either um so i'm not sure how helpful this critique is <laughs> uh i think the beginning is the biggest thing where i feel like no this is something i think i would really change because it just seems kind of flat and it's very repetitive for a long time and the rest is kind of like hmm you know let's email about this let's let's uh you tell me how much you love this um uh and what your thoughts are what do you want to keep and what do you want to do and that's for that and you do have another shot here let's listen to this here Action. No, 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 no. This is bad. This is very, very bad. This is really bad. <clears throat> oh, come on. <laughs> uh, this one. I like this. Was it, it makes me wonder, like, what is going in the back? But then the rhythm is always the same. So I would try to have a bit of a change already in there. And then as he's here, it seems like you almost want to... And I hate to go back to that Jackie thing because you don't want to stick to that. Do your own thing. But it's almost like all this up and down, up and down, up and down. And then the inhale and then this. I feel like you almost want to more energy and maybe arms go out a little shaky maybe wiggling the, the fingers and maybe some head shake just kind of letting out that energy or be getting more psyched up to be into this or 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 a bigger like on purpose opening and breathing and heavy breathing to feel like he is out of breath here so it feels like we're starting off cool and then we kind of lose that energy and then we go into higher energy again this is very very bad this is really bad and then no, watch no, no, out. This is One, bad. This is very, two, very bad. Three, this is really four. bad. It also a bit even in timing. So it'll be one, two, wait, three. Even stepping four, I guess. So one, two, pause, one, two, or one, two, three, pause, one more. Before that, it's a bit of contrast in timing. This is bad. This is bad. And watch out. Even as you even this arm is a bit different. It has a slight pose to pose twinning feel here. So just watch out for that as you continue on to offset these. It's really bad. So cool. And even this here, I like the pong pong, but it could be in combination of pong pong and an adjustment. So it's not just, I'm just moving arms. I feel like you, you need a bit more because you're swinging up and then it's kind of <laughs> constraint. And now the root is not moving. So it almost feels like as you continue on, maybe some more detail it doesn't have to be a crazy pose adjustment, but pong with maybe going too far with this leg a bit off the thing. And then as he finishes that bong bong, it settles into that position there. I would add a bit more, a bit more detail there. And then my question is, who is he doing this to? Is there someone off screen, so it's a guy on the set? This to me seems like, what's going on? He looks over and then sees the arrow, even though I know he's looking here, but it's a bit small. My, I should have made this, should have making, uh, made this bigger. But for a moment, I thought, wait, is he looking here? So he must be looking at someone off screen. But then... <clears throat> yeah, I guess why not? Hold on. This is very, very bad. This is really bad. Yeah, I mean, he is looking above that arrow. Maybe, maybe slightly pantomime me of, dude, wait, what's up? And then kind of 
kind of pointing down. I mean, like, hey, can you, do you see this? Something maybe a bit more overt. So it's not just, is he looking here because... Like, I, I feel like you want to make it extremely clear that you're you're gesturing... Well, not gesturing, but, you know, like having that contact with uh, a crew member. <clears throat> I like this, though. That's, <clears throat> and then he looks up. Okay, getting ready. Now, something must be happening. And I love this. Okay, getting ready. And no. Oh, come on! <laughs> and the come on. Crack me up. I still love that ending. Oh, come on! <laughs> Yeah, so that that would be it. Those are my my thoughts on this one. I love that face too, and I love that that's what we see first. Like, what is going on? And then this. Ah, oh, okay, cool. It's cool. I really like that shot. Just little questions here and there, maybe some suggestions. As always, uh, take what you need out of that and do your thing. All right. Thank you. All right. There's an email, you can sign up, you can start whenever you want, you can submit whenever you want, you get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right, thank you.